guys, in this video I'm going to show you how you can use your security camera from me, yeah? I'm going to be using this model, not sure if this method will be uh, useful for different models other than this one But I'm going to show you how you can use this camera with Google Home And how you can stream your videos through your Google Chromecast So as you can see in there, there is my TV, I have Google, my Google Chromecast installed uh, so you will see how I'm able to see like everything that is happening in my with my camera direct, directly in my in my TV. So it is really easy. Uh, so basically, the way that I find this it was really by accident because I I I have I was been using um, the Mi Home app. Probably if you have I don't know some G Lite bulbs or any other device from from me or, or from Xiaomi. You have been using this this application, which is really useful. I really like it. Uh, the interface the interface is really good. It has like a lot of options, whatever, right? But I was really interested the first time that I bought these uh, these bulbs. It was because apparently they have uh, compatibility with Google Assistant, right? So I was like, okay, I really want that. I really want to have that ability to turn off the lights just with my voice, to change the color, whatever. So I installed the application, the Mi Home application, I set up everything here, and I forget about the Google Assistant, right? So one day I, I was like, okay, let me start digging into the into this, let me let me figure out how, how does this work, if it is possible or it is not. So at the end, I, I start clicking everything here and I get it. I mean, I, I was really happy that it was really easy. I didn't have to look any videos or any tutorials on how to do this, how to link the Mi Home app and every device that I have installed in there between uh, uh, between Google Home. So I was really happy the way that it was really easy. You just have to click Add. Well, this is in Spanish, but it is practically the same. Then you have to click in this that it will say something like configure device or something like that then uh, it works with Google, yes it works so and in here you have to search like which application or which device and the brand that you have bought your different products right so in my case I have Mi Home and G Light uh, but in case you have any other device you can search it, search it uh, in, this, in, this list. in this list click on it and that's it so it is really simple, I really like it, but I, I knew that this camera, it didn't work with Google Home, right? It was like, uh, okay, I know that this is going to be like, I will need to use like the native app, which is Mi Home, and that's it. But as soon as I add all my bulbs to, to Google Home, I noticed that it detects my security camera. So I was like, okay, that's really interesting. Uh, so when I click in it, I was expecting to see the streaming of the of the image, to, to see the streaming of the, my camera in here, but no, it was really disappointing, right? Because the only thing that I can do in here is to see the name of the camera, to see well the home, the room, and that's it. Basically, that's all the things that you can do to the camera in the Mi Home application. So I was like, what? I mean. You're able to see it in here, probably you can add something different, probably the streaming of the video, I don't know, the configurations or whatever, but no. Basically, you cannot do that. But I was digging into, I was, I don't know, trying the Google Assistant and whatever, and I, by accident, because it was an accident, I said, stream the video into my Google Chromecast, right? I mean in Spanish, but practically that's the thing that I said. And it worked. I mean, let me show you how, how does this work, right? Quiero ver el video de seguridad en la tele de Pepe. De acuerdo. Transmitiendo mi home security camera basic 1080p en tele de Pepe. Okay, so basically that I said is that I wanted to see what is happening with my video camera in my TV. I have to say like the name of the device. The device is a Google Chromecast, probably you have a name for it. And you have to say like, I want to see the vid the security video in... Sorry, sorry. I want to see the security video in 
Google Chromecast One or whatever. So as you can see, it is really happening. I mean, it has a delay of 10, 11 seconds. I mean, as you can see, the TV was turned off, it just started the, st the streaming, so whatever, but still, it is really amazing. I never thought that it was possible for for me to, a to able to do this. I mean, in my case, it is kind of useless, at, well, at least if I, am, if I am at home, because, well, as you can see, I, can, I am able to see my, my TV, and I'm able to see my camera, it is in the same room, so I don't want to see what is happening, I mean... I, I don't see the point, but let's imagine that, I don't know, that I go to my parents' home. They have a Google Chromecast. It is already linked to my account in, in my iPad and whatever. So what I can do is, um, I don't know, I knew that I, I received an, an alarm that I see a, a movement, that a movement is detected. So I can start streaming what is happening in my house, in my parents' TV. So that, that is really amazing. Considering the fact that I thought and I read that uh, there was not compa compatibility between the camera and Google Home, and the fact that it is possible to see this and to do this, well, I have to say that I am amused, that I am really impressed about this possibility that probably no one has been talking about, but now you know, right? I mean, if you have a media app, if you have... A security camera, I'm not really sure if this works with other different type of camera, but at least for this one, it is working. So if you have this camera, you have a Google Chromecast, well, you have everything. I mean, go ahead. Also, if you have an iOS device, as myself, I have an iPad uh, right there. You have, you can download the, the, the Google Home app and uh, set up everything with it. So... Hopefully you like it. If you have any questions or any comment, please let me know. Also, if you try it with different uh, media cameras, also please let me know in the comment section below. And that's it. Thumbs up and see you on the next one. Bye-bye.